probably not the cutest angle, but starting this vlog off at night, it's about 7.20, um, so I believe this is the start of Friday's vlog. And I just went for a bike ride, so I'll just go ahead and insert that clip for you guys now. I actually went for a bike ride earlier and it was part of the end of Wednesday's vlog so it's kind of the same day I've just been kind of filming sporadically but I know this is the start of Friday for you guys and I just decided it was just such a nice day that I was going to go ride again and it was a very short one I just kind of wanted you know more fresh air I actually have the windows open in my kitchen so I'm gonna need to go close them I had them open in my office just really needing to let like the air circulate throughout the house this is something I actually don't do sometimes in a year like never and that's not really good so um, from what I've read like you should open up your windows and let like the air circulate I don't know how often but listen so I did that today and then the bike ride was really nice and yeah I actually thought that I was selling those Ikea five drawers today and then the person like kind of backed out. So I carried them by myself down the stairs today, like carried them. I don't know how I did that because they were really heavy. So now they're sitting here in the entryway and I'm just like, oh my gosh. Um, but you know what, they needed to come down anyway. So I'm just gonna get them moved into the garage so they're out of the way. Um, just kind of getting you guys caught up on some really random updates but I'm a homebody if you're new to my vlogs and my daughter's off at college and actually you'll be seeing some college content really soon and I'm just sitting here trying to get myself on schedule this is what I do kind of as part of my nightly routine that you just never see um but anyway, so I'm sitting here planning, figuring out what I need to do tomorrow, running my errands to Dollar Tree, getting my stuff filmed, the usual, and yeah. And tonight, I actually think I'm going to sleep in my room. I have not slept in my room in a while. <laughs> like, I just, uh, I don't even know. So I'm out of my office now and I'm gonna go ahead and get these moved into the garage. Oh my God bless America. Just throw your back out. it's it's done <coughs> all right so I'm also going to restart this movie another Christmas movie hitched for the holidays it's on Hallmark channel nope it's on IMDB so IMDB is free if you if you have Amazon Prime then you have access to the Amazon movies and stuff and within Amazon in case you didn't know you can also subscribe to channels some of them are free and some of them are like a monthly subscription so like my Hallmark one is like $5.99 a month IMDb is free 
they play ads. So it's kind of like that. All right. Um, so you can see the windows open here. Oh, I wanted to show you guys. I cleaned out a whole thing on this because you should have seen the ground. It was like cricket genocide. It was insane. Like I'm, 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 like I've never seen anything like this before. I must have swept up at least 200 dead crickets from here. I don't know what's going on, if anybody else is kind of experiencing the same thing, but it was intense and I've never seen anything like that in anywhere that I've ever lived. So I have no idea what that was all about, but I gave it a good sweep through and then I removed the back of those pillows. They were just kind of, they were done. This is the box from the coral bike. I put it together out here with my daughter. So I pulled the box all the way out here and then I turned the rocking chairs inward. I'm gonna rehang these lights up here. Barbecue grill out here. So what I think I'm gonna do until I get like real contractors here to work on the backyard cause I want like a pergola thing so they'll lay more concrete they'll do a pergola but i think i'm gonna go get some like cement blocks and then make a little thing right here so that the fireplace can sit on that instead of the grass so that'll be like a little a little temporary project i want to show you guys that is the moon it's a full moon and she's uh, is it a full moon I don't know, she might be like a sliver, a sliver off. I'm not entirely sure, but I didn't mow the backyard. I mowed the front the other day, but I didn't mow the back. I'll mow it next week. You can't really tell. It's just such a nice night. I hear the crickets that are alive and yeah. So anyways, it just looks so much better. I'm gonna step back so you guys can just kind of see. It was kind of appalling before. And then I had these open all day. They're like blinds that are inside the double pane window. So, um, oh, here it is. I was like, what? So it just like moves like this. Like that. I just really like my windows open. Today, I was also working on plans for the butler's pantry for Christmas. I honestly just like glazed over it and didn't think about it at all. And I was like, oh my gosh. So I got right on that, created my new list on my iPhone and I'll show you guys. All right, so here's my new list. I already have things checked off because I got either, I already own some like the red and white mugs. I got those from Dollar Tree. Sorry, my hands are shaking. And then, um, the one that says sign for mugs, Gingerbread Lane. I actually already own that. I went back through like my Christmas house tour. That's how I do like inventory. I go back and look at my videos. And I was like, okay, I'll use that sign that I already own. And then I wrote Gingerbread Men for the top shelf, which I had just bought from Hobby Lobby. And I was like, those will be great there. And then where it says Gingerbread Mug Plates for the bottom shelf, I already own those. I hauled them from a couple years ago. And then I want some cake stands and then I'll need some garland and some trees that like I'll do in place of these topiaries. And the garland I'm talking about is for here and there. So we got that going and then I also worked on my list for the kitchen as well. I went back through and I was like, okay, where do I want to kind of like improve upon? So I've been working on that, plus I ordered new bar stools. 
yeah so when i originally ordered these um they the color of the seat looked a lot lighter and more white than it is in person so and at the time i just needed bar stools i was like fine whatever i couldn't find what i wanted and i found some that i really like off of walmart and they're white they're like wood white so they're just gonna blend in so much nicer and i'm very excited so i'll be doing that whole setup for the Christmas kitchen. And I think I'm also gonna be decorating the library since we're talking about decorations. Um, I am gonna be decorating the library for Christmas. So it's gonna be pretty minimal. It's gonna be plaid, so it'll like match this space. I'm just gonna be getting rid of like the sunflowers. I'm gonna be doing like a more wintry mix here. And then I'll be doing some plaid pillows, keeping it really simple, but at least doing something and at least kind of removing the sunflowers because I feel like, you know, that will kind of throw it off a little bit. And then this needs to get put away, so I'm going to take it upstairs. I have a bin that I've already started, and oh, I'm going to take you guys and show you what I worked on the other day. Socks off camera. So I found a solution to all of the storage for Halloween. All right, so here's the bin that's empty. So I have it labeled. It's actually a mix. It'll be a mix of Halloween and fall in here. And I've been using these from Dollar Tree, these little shipping labels. <sighs> you guys, I'm always out of breath. Anyways, I also cleaned up up here because I slept here last night. So I put away all my blankets and stuff. I just need to put up these pillows. But look at this. The last time you guys saw this section, it was filled to the brim. So my daughter's room's looking a little crazy. And if she saw this, she'd have a heart attack because she is very particular about her bed. Luckily, she doesn't watch my videos. So she ain't gotta know. Um, but I started pulling out Christmas stuff from this attic that we access through her room, which is so bizarre, but like. And I cleaned out, um, so there's stuff in the back, but I cleaned it out and then I was able to get all of these Halloween bins, which I also labeled. You can see this one's fall. They're not sticking very well. Um, you can see all my Halloween ones here. So, and look at all of the space I still have. Like, I have space to walk in here, but I'm very excited. So, this will be my fall and Halloween storage, and then my Christmas storage will be in my garage. So, I'm so happy that I solved all of that. As you can see, I have these pieces here. I don't actually know if I'm ready to get rid of these two or not. I was going to hang on to them for a little bit longer. And then this piece is just, I love this piece. I honestly don't think I can part with it. So once I'm done filling this up, so I'll go get the black crows and get them settled in here. And then I'm gonna try to get like all these little bits, like the ghost and all the little spiders. I'm gonna get them in this box as well. Hopefully I can get like the rest of the upstairs into this box. I'm sure it'll be a tight fit, but hopefully we can do it. And then I'll get this put in the attic and then I think I'll have one or two more boxes for fall to put up. So entryway, living room, and kitchen. It seems like I have a lot to put up. Like these are fake pumpkins, so these would take up some space, but like that's a real pumpkin. Um, these are real pumpkins, so obviously I couldn't hang on to those. <laughs> <laughs> 